Close your eyes and watch your breath. Gather your thoughts right here, right here in the present moment, because it's in the present moment that the mind is making its decisions, and its decisions are going to have an impact not only in the present moment but also on into the future. So you want to be really clear about what choices you're making. And you can be clear only when you're really right here. In other words, otherwise you're traveling off someplace else. It's like the owner of a factory. Tells the workers what to do, but then disappears. And the workers will do sometimes what the owner wants, and sometimes they'll do what they want. In other words, the different parts of your mind, which is like a big committee, will suddenly assert themselves. And if you're not there to keep a check on them, who knows what decisions are going to be made. All too often you ask someone, why did you do that? And they can't really give you a clear answer, because they weren't there. They're off someplace else. So try to be here in the present moment and be with a sense of well-being, otherwise it's going to be hard to stay. So learn how to breathe in a way that feels good all the way in, all the way out. So mind is a good place to stay. That way whatever comes up, it can see clearly. Whether a choice is being made in the right direction or the wrong direction, you'll know. And you can have some influence on pushing everything in the direction that really will be good for you and for the people around you. So keep reminding yourself to stay here, because that's the other problem is you're here, but then you sometimes forget and you're off someplace else. You have to keep reminding yourself, this is where you want to be, these are the choices you want to make. It's only in that way that the choices get well made, because you can learn a lot of things and stash them away. But if you can't access them, if you can't remember them, it's, they're pretty useless. So try to remember that you want to act and speak and think in ways that are skillful, that don't harm you, don't harm other people. And keep reminding yourself that that's what you want to use as your standard for judgment. So get the mind in the right place and use the right standard of judgment. And the choices you make will be a lot more in line with what you really want to do, really want to say, really want to think, really want to attain in life.